Yes, I know the garage is three wheelerless. We have to fix that. Here is the beast in the garage in a box. And it is dirty. But you know what they say? Dirt don't hurt. What a stupid saying. That's uh, the same thing was said by my uncle after, before he threw a chunk of uh, frozen earth at me. Good thing we put it inside. We left the spark plug right out. Debris could have got in there. So, uh, yeah, we'll push this out. We're going to tackle this thing. I think I have every single part. It came, everything came like a few days before like it was they were supposed to. Besides the shipping, I'm also happy because I got cookies. I like cookies. Let that thing do its job. Get this white stuff off of here. This is the air box right here. Well, this is the boot that leads to the air box. And then the only thing I can see, this is my first uh, Yamaha three-wheeler. So I've never seen how the air filter works. I don't know how a lot of this stuff works. So this is literally a first time for potentially both of us and I know what you're you're thinking or know what you're wondering and yes those cookies were very good I'm glad I ate them one more I like how it's even labeled upper Sweet! We got mice again! This one's probably living. Now, if something jumped out at me right now, that would be scary. I don't see any eyes. That was one silly decision by me, is to not buy the air filter now. Or, not look at the air filter before, but... You know, it's an air filter. What, what could possibly go wrong? No, what it really was, was the fact that it didn't have the box up top. So, like, I didn't even think of it as silly as that sounds. Look at all the... Look at all that. Just like my jokes, let's start to suck. <laughs> slight concern and that is with the new key switch they said that it would work for the year following this one but at the same time a comment said that it would work but the line was just a little short and I'm hoping that maybe they fixed it and they just uh, kept the same listing or whatever so Uh, looks like Looks like that nah, It might just be long enough What do you guys think it is? Really you think it's that? No, come on now. We didn't need one of them. Maybe in the bedroom, but not. Just kidding, kidding. Yes, it's a battery. Okay, it comes with a bunch of nice cardboard. Can use that later. But yeah, sweet, sealed. No juices are gonna fly anywhere. Hook that up to the trickle charger. 1.5 amp. Let's see if we can. Red on black and 
black on red. This not even really plug. Where are you? Okay, we don't need the vacuum anymore because we're done sucking. Well, as far as that goes. There we go. As far as this box, this oh that's right, that's the oil filter. Here's our oil filter. Slightly different from the old one. The old one had um, like more of a metal uh, style to it. This is fiber, and it's uh, it's just an overall different. Hopefully, it works better. How's <laughs> that? It's different. And also, uh, carburetor. Hopefully, we don't need it. Who on earth put that six millimeter in my hand? There we go. So we got the chode. Then you got the other guys. You got me. New oil filter. Easy peasy lemon squeezy. Oh, I got visitors. Can you hear them at the door? The gas mask. I had to check my meter. That guy just doesn't like the, that cable, just sits slightly in the way. We'll be using the dartboard special here. What do we got? 10W40, that'll work perfectly. I'm pretty sure I put the plug in. How many cores does this thing even take? So the oil ended up taking about 1.75 quarts and uh, while I was filling it up I noticed this. This says decrease here and it says increase here and I'm assuming it's for this bolt. Now I don't know and it doesn't seem to be very tight um, what that does. Yeah that was loose. That happened. No, it's a freaking 12. So if this thing doesn't move or or does something funky, I'm assuming that it has something to do with this. And that's tight now. I asked you guys on the last video of this. This looks like an eyeglass to me. Granted, it's still dirty. And people said that is the fill plug. I just... And, and that's where it usually is. I just never have seen anything like that. All right, ladies and gentlemen. If you, if you watched the go-kart video, you would have already seen this. Here is the carburetor to the Yamaha 225DX. After about four hours of being ran in the ultrasonic cleaner, you can see it's got like a marble look to it. It stained the seat. The, the brass is a different color. So I'm going to go ahead and spray that off. That's what that looks like. The carburetor itself. The float looks brand new now. Nice and shiny, love that. The 
Look at the grime we caught. Look at that. Look at all the grime we caught in there. Holy smokes. Look at that. Wow, look at that. Nice and clean, nice and clean. That's what I'm talking about. You remember what the bowl looked like? Well, now look at the bowl. Brand new after I sprayed out with some carb cleaner. Sweet. If you guys want to get an ultrasonic cleaner like this, like I said before, in the comment section below, uh, if you go to my gear uh, link down there, it'll take you to my Amazon stuff. And that's where you can see the tools that I use. My ultrasonic cleaner's on there. A few other tools are on there too. Here's our slide. I'm looking forward to having that actually move up and down in the carb relatively easy and not need uh, transmission fluid or carb cleaner to make it move. What do you guys think? Is it gonna work or is it not gonna work? We'll slap it back together. Check that out. Slightly better than before, huh? Get a little bit of a bounce action now. Sweet, I like that. Can anybody remember how many turns we were at? I think I can. I'm gonna set it to it anyways. If you know, leave it in the comment section below. Tell me if you were right or wrong. I believe it was two and an eighth. So there's our eight. Half, 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 two. Where is... That's too small. Knock it off in your... That's what she said jokes, you guys. <laughs> And do the old shake test. Flow sounds good. That's ready to be installed. Once we get the go kart out of the way, yep, that's right. I'm filming the go kart video right now. If you haven't seen the go kart video yet, check it out. I don't know if I have got it to run yet or not, but you should know by now. I think that's how it works. Oh, and and by the way. Before Christmas, we're running a, a deal on machinemerch.com or 3dmachines.co. After you spend 25 bucks, you get a free $10 beanie. I'm plugging it because I want to keep your heads warm. And yes, I want uh, your Christmas money. You don't fill this can with hopes and dreams. Not talking because <laughs> this takes concentration. <laughs> on there that's the trickiest part it should be at least I don't know if you can see it in there but it's sitting crooked why are you not going down in that
There you go. How's the saying go? An ounce of prevention is worth a pound of cure or something like that. I also failed to check the the petcock on this thing. It was already bone dry. So same thing as the air filter, you know, it's not there, you just don't take it into account, you know, all the time. <laughs> so it's bone dry. I'll uh, leave it off of the machine and I'll fill this with gas after I check to make sure it's clean. The good stuff too, it's getting 91. I don't know if it's ethanol free or not. So we got some flow. Holy smokes, the fat cock works. fuel on the floor there from you know doing our small little test there this line it's shot <laughs> that line is so shot it's got a new air it's got a new uh, fuel filter on it though that looks really good but that is shot That's that's how hard it is. <laughs> I've never I've never seen a razor break like that. It's hard. through the horde found a couple different ones here I think this is gonna be our best bet it's even slightly longer if it's even got clamps on it wow if oh she's gonna have to bore right out Maybe. Maybe. Oh yeah. Got it. But now the thing is, it's gonna jam around the carburetor. Will the clamp even go on? <sighs> yep. Tight and loose, I guess. that key will the carburetor work we'll find out after these messages our neutral light isn't hooked up so we're not going to know if that works just yet 
but we can check it for spark. We can check to see if the starter works. We can check a lot of things here. Okay, we'll start with starter button, see if that works. First, we gotta turn it on. Spark, is it? Spark. We're sparking. Turn the key the other way. It doesn't even start. Sweet. So the key works. Very good. Very good. luck yet. Walked away for a few minutes after the phone call and uh, it's leaking gas, but actually it looks like it might just be coming out of the screw I undone. What the heck? Uh, this was confusing me like crazy. This little piece of plastic here was on this Allen head because that's what they usually have on them. And I'm like, is that a sight glass? What the heck is going on there? No, I'm looking for this guy. But the problem is, I think this is a different size. Yeah, but it is. That one's the six. And I didn't return it. Overflowing, that means we got enough in there. People said to take about a quarter quart. I don't even think I put that amount in there, and it was still coming out. So, not very much lubes needed.
carburetors off the three wheeler right now. I took these ear cleaners here, threw a little brake cleaner down the seat here. And as you can see, the ends of those aren't that clean. So I cleaned it with, I think two or three um, of those. So that's way cleaner. Should be about the cleanest that I could get it. We'll put it back together and see if, it's, if it continues to leak. It's sad to say it, but that didn't fix it. Turn the fuel on, and it's just coming right out. So the needle and seat for that thing is about what it costs for a whole new carb. So we're gonna have to use the carb that I bought. That stinks. I guess we're gonna recycle this guy. Why is our brand new carburetor leaking? Okay, no, it stopped. <laughs> That's good. But still, why did it even leak to begin with? Man, does it smell like gas. We should probably, um... There might be a fire. My GoPro ran out of footage, but it's running now. It starts, it started right up. I adjusted this sleeve here and uh, dialed in the, the idle there. And it sounds really good. Now that noise, that knocking noise, sounds like it's coming from over here. So I'm assuming it has something to do with that. That's gonna do it for this 3D Machines production. I hope you guys enjoyed it. I've been trying to upload like crazy, you guys, for you guys, for the Christmas time giving. It's the time of giving, I guess. Uh, but yeah, any information that you could leave in the comment section below, I would really appreciate it. And hopefully, if you guys give me enough information and if I do enough research, this will be the last uh, work on Will It Run video, and we'll be ripping it. Next time you see it, we'll put it together, rip it, see what it does. I'm excited. Stay for your press, stay super fly. Until next time, you can go to 3dmachines.com or 3dmachines.co or machineworks.com. Get yourself a beanie, a $10 beanie for free after you spend 25 bucks before shipping. That's my plug, I got a plug. Take care. Have a great night, you sexy animal.